to you. I was literally having this conversation yesterday with it with a client. Um, the only person who gets bored of your content is you. You should absolutely reuse your content. You can either reuse it in its entirety, sparingly, or you can have two or three different variations of that content and use them a little bit more regular content. So that's the other thing I would say to consider is when you're looking at creating more consistent content is, you know, um, so an example, a real example is um, I want to create a, a post that talks about 10 tips for websites, how to create websites um, most effectively, my top 10 tips. So if you want to repurpose that, you can also talk about 10 things that cause websites to fail. And it's the opposite of the top 10 things that you do to make them win. So then you've got two posts from just that one idea. And there's loads of variations of that. Um, you can then talk about the individual 10 tips one at a time in much more depth and detail. So all of a sudden from one idea, you've got maybe 12, 30, um, because if you can tell people that if they come back and follow your content tomorrow, um, that they'll see the next part of this, then it starts to get people in the habit of following what you do and they'll be more likely to engage and, and contribute in the future. So that's a really useful idea.